Hello everyone, today I would like to talk about a library called Aphelion. Aphelion is a special effects library which you can download for $59. I'll post uh, the link underneath this video. It's actually not a contact library. Uh, if you download it, it is a bundle of WAV files that you get. Now some people will prefer to use WAV files directly to import them directly into their DAW. I prefer, I, or I chose to uh, create contact patches out of them. Uh, it's just the, the way I prefer to work, so that's up to you. In any case, if you want to do that as well, you will have to do it yourself. If you don't know how to do that, uh, there are videos on uh, YouTube which show you how to create your own um, patches with uh, WAV files. Aphelion is a library with really a lot of content. It contains uh, down risers, up risers, so risers and downers in other words, hits, uh, whooshes, and also some rhythmic loops and processed samples. I've created a whole bunch of patches and every key uh, that is blue in, in every patch contains a different sound. Uh, I will play a, a number of sounds of all the categories, so I'll play, I'll play some down risers and some hits and some whooshes and so on. And I'll uh, try to mention also how many uh, wave files you get for each of those types of sounds. So I'll dive straight in and uh, I'll comment in between uh, which type of sounds I'm playing. I'll also try to uh, upload an, an image of uh, of the contact uh, patch. Again, I've created it myself. I, I used uh, the image that I found of Aphelion to create this patch. Uh, there are no, um, of course, no effects that you can use because I just imported the WAV files as they are. And if I want to put uh, any reverb on it or anything like that, I do that in my DAW, not... Uh, uh, via contact so uh, what you hear is exactly how you get it when you download it so we'll start with the long down risers <laughs> Okay, next are the short down risers. You get uh, in total 11 WAV files for the short down risers, so I'll play a few of them. Next are the long hits, and you get no less than 105 long hits. So I had to divide that over a bunch of patches. Um, yeah, I said it already, a lot of content in here. So here we go. Okay, if you think that 105 long hits is a lot, then you're going to be surprised when you hear the short hits, because there's no less than 267 of those. I didn't even put them all into a patch yet. Uh, I think I created three patches, so that's uh, a bit, little bit less than uh, 100 uh, hits that I've used already. So I'll play a few of those that I've already put into contact. Then you get a few low subs, there's uh, only five of them, but they sound really nice.
Then we have 50 processed samples. Then there's the rhythmic loops and you get exactly 100 of those. Okay, one thing I didn't mention about the rhythmic loops is that the names of the wave files start with a number, 0, 90, 100, and so on. So I'm guessing that that is the tempo which is indicated there in the, in the wave file's name. I'm not 100% sure I didn't uh, test it, I didn't check it, so I'm sorry, I didn't do my homework very well. Um, but yeah, I'm guessing that that's the tempo. Okay. Next up are the uh, uprisers, long uprisers or risers, however you want to call them. So we have longs and shorts. I'm going to start with the longs. Okay, as you can hear, they're not all uh, equally long, obviously, I would say, but some of them are rather short. So I'm, I personally would have categorized them under the, the short uh, uprisers, but okay. So next up are the short uh, risers. One thing I forgot to mention is how many uh, wave files you get uh, for this. For the long risers, you get a total of 35 wave files, and for the short risers, you get a total of 59. Then we have the last category, which is the wishes. You have again longs and shorts. There is a total of 59 long wishes wave files and um, 66 short ones. What's also nice, uh, especially, well, what's nice if you import it into a contact, if you create a contact pat patch with these um, wave files, is that you can play some of them together while you're actually using only one track in your, in your uh, sequencer. Uh, sometimes it, it sounds good to combine a number of them. Sometimes it's better to just use one. That's a matter of taste, of course. Uh, so I will start with the long wishes and um, maybe I'll combine a few here and there. Uh, every now and then so uh, when I'm playing it's not necessarily just one uh, wave file so the long wishes That last sound that you heard was a combination of eight 
different uh, whooshes. So I held down eight keys. And uh, you hear the effect. It gives you an even richer uh, and more full uh, effect. So it's uh, definitely uh, a nice idea to combine a number of, uh, in this case, whooshes. But it will also work with, uh, with the risers, uh, probably. So, yeah, definitely something to experiment with. Last uh, patch I want to play a few sounds of are the short whooshes. Um, same thing here, you can also combine a few, so uh, I will do that as well. I will play some single uh, keys and then some combined ones. As you heard, I did a few combinations there also uh, in the end. So that's it for this uh, demo. Check out their website. It's called particular-sound.de. You can download the Affilion library there. I also know that there's another library coming up from Particular Sound. I don't know when the release date will be. Cannot say much about it, so uh, check out the website and keep an eye on it. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, please do. I am planning to review another number of um, contact libraries for which I did not find a YouTube video yet. So thanks for now and see you next time.